Hi, my name is Steve Hartz. I created Opacity, which is an easy-to-use add-in or plug-in for PowerPoint that produces some useful and interesting effects. Careful use of these effects will help you become a better presenter. Let me show you what Opacity can do. First off, the basic Opacity effect is for you if, for example, you are a doctor or a lawyer and need to hide the identity of people in your slides. In a few seconds you can blur the part of the slide you want to hide without damaging the picture underneath. Taking this a step further, suppose you have a slide with a list of points you want to reveal. Here's a new way of doing it. Hide the later points with blurred images and then remove them one by one. It focuses your audiences much more than just making the points fly in. One Opacity customer took this a stage further and used this in a product launch like this. On the left is the old version that everyone knew and then he revealed the new. Or you can use Opacity with a PowerPoint animation to make a sophisticated title slide. Let me tell you about that. Before I created Opacity I did this effect with copies of my picture in Photoshop. Lining them up on the slide was a nightmare and the whole thing took hours. With Opacity I did this slide in just a few minutes. Taking the idea of revealing things a bit further, some people, teachers in particular, have used Opacity to create fun visual quizzes. Showing a blurred picture gives a bit of a clue but not too much. Here's an extra twist. By putting one blurred image on top of another, you can control the level of clues, like this. Finally, for this video, have you ever had a slide where the photo was important but the background was distracting? Using Opacity, you can blur the background slightly, making the foreground stand out. So, you've just seen six uses for Opacity in this video. Watch the next one to see seven more. The last one will amaze you.